What is going on guys? It is your boy Ed coming at you with a video for you guys today. All, uh, first things first, I want to thank you all for the followers on Supercard. If you guys didn't know, they implemented a brand new follower thing so you guys can keep track of everyone you want to. So a big thank you to everyone who followed me. If you guys want to follow me, all you have to do is uh, type in my name. It's kind of hard to find me like name wise. But you could just search up my ID 390405 and that should bring up me. If you guys want to give me a follow, that'd be great. I think there's like a 40, 50 follow limit. So if you want to follow me, you're more than welcome to follow me. But I got other things that I really want to discuss in this video because it just needs to be said how Supercard always like excites people and then can just destroy everything in just a matter of seconds let's talk about that so as you all know ladies and gentlemen we currently have the spring eastern event happening right now and many people were really 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 excited for this event uh obviously we're gonna get the triple h thing next week so that's cool and all but let's just say like so we, we we've been pulling these cars off the board a Vanguard Leo Rush, uh, a Triple H WrestleMania, uh, Cameron Grimes, and obviously we need this for the quest. So I, we figured these would be easily pullable, or they would hatch into something. We, we got the British Bulldog. So yeah, we got, I pretty much have pulled every one so far. Uh, some people have pulled two Triple H's, three Triple H's. And the problem is though is all these cards are not going to do anything at all. Now you're probably wondering, Ed, like, what is the point of this? These cards do absolutely nothing. So I'm going to show you guys a tweet. That's Supercard. Well, it's Help Supercard, but it's basically Supercard. Tweet it out. Uh, eggs are Supercar are superstar cards that can be collected off the draft board and in some packs this month. They don't hatch but can be used to fulfill quest items. Obviously we have a quest for image swapping. Yes, it's a lovely image for training in active or legacy fusions to pro for catalog stars. So everything that we thought we were gonna get something cool out of these things that we're gonna hatch has been totally destroyed and rendered absolutely useless to us all which means again this event is only pretty much for the paid players again another event where the free players get a foot right up the ass and there's absolutely nothing to do and right now this world's still in a crisis guys we have another we have months before we're back to normal again you know but, you know, congrats to everyone who got their $1,200 check. When I saw my bank this morning, I was so happy. But anyways, uh, yeah. Right now the world's in a pain. And not everyone out there is going to have the whole spend money aspect right now. People don't want to spend money because they don't, they're not making much at all. And here we are. More greed and greed of Season 6. Season 6 has just been a greed of a tear. It hasn't been hobby-like at all. It hasn't been free at all. It's been a pay-to-win season this season. It's been freaking terrible. And I just want to know, like, what is Supercard doing? Now, a lot of people want us YouTubers, like, boycott and all that stuff. Obviously, you know, I could see why we could. But, again, boycotting would only hurt us in the long run. Uh, people tell me, hey, Ed, don't go for an event card. Well, me not having that event card will get me killed in other type of aspects of, like, hey, I can't even do my events now because I didn't get this event card. I can't win King of the Rings because I didn't get this event card. For standing up for the, standing up for something that if Supercard doesn't do anything, then I basically boycott it for nothing because at the end of the day, yes, they have, they have to make money. I get that. But I'd rather them hear our voices and our frustrations instead of me having to say, hey, I'm not going to play this event. And then the only person who's truly getting screwed is me at the end of the day. So that's why a lot of people, I always tell them, like, hey, boy, for me, boycotting isn't a thing. <laughs> it's not something I would want to do. 
but again supercar uh, supercar 2k like this just this just isn't it you guys are losing the plot you guys are going to be losing a lot of people as you keep making this season pay to win and just thinking about money 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 it's just not working out you guys got to do so much better like this is the one promotion you could have done it makes so many free players happy. You know, it's the NWO stuff. They're like a lot of people, a lot of free players got screwed. They they thought, hey, maybe I'll be able to get something here, and no, again, screwed again, over and over and over again. Like I, f I feel for the free players because their base cards honestly feel so effing useless, and for people like myself and other spenders out there, we feel like we have all the power right now because y'all can't touch us. And it sucks because I think free players should have a chance to at least have an opportunity to, to destroy us. And I feel like they don't. It's just terrible. So, guys, all those cards you have right now, you guys all got excited for. I saw the comments on my YouTube saying, oh, my God, Edward, I pulled a Triple H. I can't believe it. I can't wait. If this, I'm probably going to get a pro of him. I'm sorry to say this. Your card is absolutely useless at this point. Now, I would save it just in case they change their minds down the road. But... This is this is terrible. A lot of like when you make Biggie Dude mad, you know you messed up. <laughs> Biggie Dude was even going off on this, and it's it's quite sad. It's quite sad. I, I have no other words to describe how Supercar just keeps messing up. They take one step forward and take three steps back every single time. I just I just don't get it. They, like, do they? I, I, to this point, I just don't think they listen to the feedback at all. They just don't. They just say they do, and then they say, "All right, I guess let's go back to what we're, doing, what we're doing." Like, ugh, I don't get it. But yeah, guys, I just wanted to make this quick video for you guys to let you guys know about what this means for everyone. So, if you guys pulled your egg cards from the draft board, they mean absolutely nothing at this point. Just enjoy the image, I guess. But other than that, like, what the hell? Terrible. Just terrible.